Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mylene and welcome to my summer pixie pick. Okay, I have chosen a pixie that I am in love with. I'm going to show it to you in five colors. That's how much I like it. We're going to talk all about it, look at all the details about the cap, about these different colors. I can't wait to show you, so get ready for my summer pixie pick. All right, my pick for the, my favorite pixie for the summer is Ellen Villa Alon. If you follow me on Instagram, you've seen me wear Alon over and over and over again. I talk about it over there all the time. I have fallen in love with this wig for lots of reasons. Now, I also love Ellen Villa Open. That's another pixie that I really like, but I have to tell you, I think Alon has just taken that number one place. Of course, now this can change daily, right? <laughs> as wig wearers, we have the opportunity to change our hair as much as we want every day. I might wear this super short pixie in the morning and something long at night, and that is exactly what I love about this wig journey. All right, let's talk about a line. Now, first of all, I want to let you know all of these wigs are from Wig Studio One. I either purchased them or they were provided to me for previous reviews. So just to let you know that. And I also purchased a few of these off of clearance at wigstudio1.com. Keep an eye on that clearance section. You can find lots of good things. First of all, let's just talk about this cap construction. This is available, Alon is available in 11 shades. I really hope they add some more shades because I might need a few more. That's how much I like this wig. These are heat friendly fibers. Now, I want you to see this has what they call a mini lace front. Honestly, I can live with it or without it. I don't wear this wig off my face in any way. So to me, eh, you know, it's fine. If you like that, you want to have that off your, you know, wear your hair back right there and see that, that's okay. But like I said, I honestly can live with it or without it. And I always am honest to you about how I feel about these wigs. There is permatees in this wig, yes indeed. If you don't like permatees, this is this is not your wig. It's not a huge amount of permatees, but if you don't like permatees at all, you will not like this. Another thing, don't try to make this wig something it isn't. This is spiky, fun, short, short hair. That's exactly what this is. It's what it's meant to be. So just know that when you order it, it's a little wild, it's a little crazy. Right up my alley. I really like this short nape and how it fits really, really tight to the neck. You can move your head anyway. It's not going anywhere. I love to wear it with just exactly like what I have on a blue jean shirt, collar popped. I am ready to go. All right, so again, back to the cap, open wefted, closed ear tabs with stays. It has this extended felt nape and Velcro adjusters. This actually fits me a little large. I have a 21 and a quarter inch head circumference and I feel like I can always bring this in a little bit to get a really snug fit. Just want to make you aware of that. Okay, so the front of this is three and a half. So it has these little three and a half inch bangs. The crown is four and a half. It has a short sides and nape of 1.25. Now, like I said, if you have hair that grows down on your neck, this might not work for you. Just letting you know that up front because it does have this short 1.25 inch nape. But this is just a winner. Okay, so the color I have on, this is Hot Flame Mix. It's a wow color, right? I really, really like this color. Dark brown root here. Then it's just blended with all these different shades of red. I want you to see. I have some outdoor video I will insert as well, but Hot Flame Mix. Okay, let's move on to another color. This next color was my first color I got in this, and 
Uh, I believe that Week Studio One sent me this one. I think I purchased all the rest of these, but they sent me this one to review. And this color is the Metallic Blonde Rooted. I fell in love with this color. I wish they would um, make this color in a lot more styles because I think it's very wearable. I think if you're thinking of going gray, this is a nice place to start as well. Has the dark root and then has this pearl platinum and some gray running through it. So to me, this is a great transition color, like I said, if you're going gray. All right. Love it. Metallic blonde rooted. You see what I did? I took it out of the box. I threw it on my head. I'm ready to go. And that is it. <laughs> is all I'm going to do. Metallic Blonde Rooted. Okay, let's move on. This next color, you're going to be shocked. This is Espresso Mix, which is a blend of black and dark brown. Now, I told you I'm going to show you every color that I can. Now, I'm not saying this color's for me. In no way am I saying that. So don't leave me a message and tell me that that's not for you. That's okay. Please know my channel is nothing to do with me. This channel is about you all about you, the viewer. My job is to show you as much as I can, a variety of styles, color, everything I can show you. That's my job as a reviewer. I want you to see everything. I don't want to show you what I think looks good on me. That has nothing to do with it. I want to show you about what might look good on you, what you might see and go, oh gosh, I really want to try that. So that's what this channel is about. So I always just want to make that clear. I know this is too dark for me, but you know what? I'm still going to try it on and I'm still going to show it to you. <laughs> Because you know what? This might be your color. And there are so many people that love these dark colors. And I'm so glad that we have them to offer so we all have something. We want everyone to have a color they like. I personally think this is a beautiful color. Like I said, probably not for me. I'm very fair. So not the best for me. But gosh, what a beautiful color. Espresso mix. Yep, just gorgeous. All right, so we've got on espresso mix, and now we're going to move to light champagne rooted. How beautiful. Dark roots. Then it's blended with ash, which I personally love. Ash wigs that have any kind of ash color in them, I'm drawn to. And there's some light golden blonde in this as well. Really pale, but it is definitely there. Y'all, the wig grip I have on is from Wig Studio One, and if you will look in the drop-down box below this video, I have a video that shows how I have a link to this uh, wig grip on the Wig Studio One website, so you can see it. I also have a video of how I put on my wig cap and wig grip if you're interested in that. Okay, let's look at light champagne rooted. I love this color. So we've gone from really dark to really light. Now, this has some longer pieces on the top, and I personally really like that because that gives me extra things to spike up, which I'm all about. So, if you don't like these really longer pieces, you could trim those if you wanted to, but I like them. And this color is so cute. Light, champagne rooted. They do such a good job with this rooting. It is just truly believable. The last color I want to show you is one that is new to me, but I am going to be looking for it in other styles because I really like it. The Plum Brown Rooted. This has dark roots, and then it has this dark auburn running through it, and some red violet. Also dark brown. So it's very blended through here with these different shades. I think it's so pretty. I was so glad that I got it. This is one I got on clearance at Wig Studio One. Again, they change, they update that almost every day. So be sure to go over there and check that out. But this is pretty. I really fell in love with Plum Brown Rooted. And I'm just going to spray some plain water 
because you know I do that this would also be great this week to do some peace out cream on here any kind of texturing spray or cream to spike this up just make it messy y'all just let it like I said let this be what it is and there you go now seriously does it get any easier than that thanks so much for joining me today I hope you will try a lot it is just such a fun pixie throw on and go you can just be out the door in a matter of seconds and aren't we lucky to have all of these beautiful different colors to choose from different wigs to choose from embrace your wig journey it's your journey it's nobody else's wear what you think makes you feel beautiful no matter what anybody else says if you love fun short spiky hair please wear it put a smile on your face go out wear that hair and enjoy it it's what it's all about thank you again and i will see you next time